You now, oh, uh, you now tuned in to FTS podcast. Your boy DJ Two Fifty in the building with O Styles Haynes. And today's topic is cheating. And no. oh, wait, actually, the topic is um, opposite, opposite sex friendships. Opposite sex friendships. All Can't right. get it out. So, what do you think about opposite sex friendships? Like, are they capable of? happening or do i think it's okay like what do you what mean are, what are some of your rules of the person you're dating um what's some of the rules of their friendship no the phone calls sex? during booty call hours like from what the opposite sex that? that's anytime after midnight it's a booty call hour no there's what no if, reason your girlfriend should be calling you if it's an emergency yeah then i can understand that but it can't be no after 12 o'clock on a regular basis. You know it's an emergency if it happened out of nowhere. You know what I mean? Like, But every time Sean the name popping up on the screen and it's after midnight, it's a problem. What if it's an emergency <laughs> booty call? No, 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 not that kind of emergency. Then right. Sean need to be deleted. <laughs> I I think, um, I don't know, like, I had, a, I had an ex that she wanted to be too close, like, my thing is, if you text somebody that you used to date, I can understand, like, every so often, every month or two, like, hey, how you been? You good? Oh, okay. I just wanted to see how you doing. But every day? No. You don't she think every... She still love you, boo. She still love you. I mean, no, 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 no. I mean, as far as a female having her ex's text every day is, like, that should be that i don't i don't think that's acceptable i was gonna say are you the jealous type do you get no no no, no, no. kind of situation i mean it's not the it's it's not the fact that a jealous type it's just the fact of i think it's too much i think it's like a disrespect to the relationship of a person that you with is like again i'm i'm far from insecure but my thing is like what do you have to talk about with an ex every day that's true you know what i'm saying like a relationship is supposed to be Hey, um, you know, like I said, I, I think it's too much. You don't every day. That is too much. Like, why did y'all break up if he was gonna communicate like that every day? <laughs> exactly. So let me see. Why do you think people cheat? Like, as far as why do you think males cheat, and why do you think females cheat? Um, I think males cheat because it's just part of their nature. And don't get me wrong. That's false. I don't mean it in the sense of every man we has to We feel lonely it. inside. <laughs> I say that now, as I don't be in cheating. like... I don't be cheating. I'm not a cheater, but I'm just saying. I, I think some men are really emotional inside. And sometimes, like, the woman don't fulfill his, 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 uh, his needs emotionally, like... Sometimes we want roses. Like, sometimes we laying right next to y'all and we just feel unloved and, like, we're just laying there by ourselves. And sometimes that side chick just makes you feel like, I love you, daddy. <laughs> well, if she call you daddy, but. So you need to talk it out with the person you with. Like, it's not really worth What if she don't want to call cheat? me daddy? Uh, you, you, you might got to get a side chick that call you daddy. Just or because, if she's Puerto Rican, cause... poppy. <laughs> So, it's not in their nature, no? Oh, you want to hear something funny? I had this post up yesterday, and a guy had wrote out, like, a whole list of, like, 20, 30 times that his wife wouldn't put out. And he wrote out the reasons, stuff like that. So, how many times, if, if you don't give your man something, like, 10 times, do you feel like he has a right to cheat? If... I feel like no. Why? Everybody goes through a dry spell. Like Why? you wouldn't appreciate it if he, the shoe was on it, the other foot. It would never be a time that should come for the me, and I would say no. Like no. I, I mean, like if it's like eight, maybe eight nine days straight, I might have to take a nap. But <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know a lot of dudes that's just like I'm not. In, I'm not in the mood to do it right now. No. So that's what I'm saying. How many times would you say, you know what? I didn't give you some ten times. I, it's it's fine. You can have a side chick. I can't even answer that. I don't even know, like, because just the way I'm thinking about it is, 
if that's the arrangement, just fucking go for it. Like, I, I don't know what to say. All right. Now, what I'm going to ask is, how many times is a man allowed to cheat in a relationship that a woman should stay? That definitely depends on the situation because to each his own. So like, so once once is you consider one time cheating okay? I consider the first time cheating a possible mistake. How is a mistake? Everybody slips up eventually. Like, nobody is truly an angel. Nah. Yeah. You Listen, got those good ones, but I feel like yo, I expect my, it. Like, I can't of, even say. One of my friends made it sound like he was a puppy. Like, no, he's doing good now. He's better. He's getting better. <laughs> he's, he's come a fun. long way. Yeah. <laughs> Graduated from the training pads. My thing is, yeah, my thing is, is. You know, I don't. I don't really think there's no excuse whether male or female. Um, some people will make cheating seem like it's the other person, but no, I mean, it's definitely you. Yeah. Like that's one thing you can't ever say. I cheated because they made me do it. They can't make you cheat. You so think, wait, that's all your own choice. So you would forgive. You would forgive him the first time. I would forgive the first time. Because you didn't buy him flowers, would that be a good enough reason? I think I will even accept that reason. Why? Because, yes, men like to be pampered, too. I, I admit that. Men do like to be pampered. All right. We forget as women. So, this after the first time, what would you say after the second time? After the second time, you're just a chronic cheater and you did it on purpose. Like, there's no, oh, I was What's drunk. What's a chronic the, cheater? Just that means somebody cheating. who just get their kicks off of cheating just because, like, like a chronic my, liar, my you thing, gotta keep thing, doing it. My thing is this: if if you, if you hook them up like at least uh, three times a week, make three, maybe four times a week, then it's no reason. But if you make them go a whole week or two weeks without, like, or even a month, because I know it's, it's like <laughs> sending them out there with a loaded gun. Like you don't do that. Yeah, you can't. You, you can't, don't do that. You can't. Be You're not supposed that. to do that to them. Yeah. So, that's the end of the podcast. Peace.